Hi, this is Tim from Latest 3DS Games and I'm here with another quick video. Now, uh, you've probably been hearing lately over the last couple of years about how the um, iPads and the um, new technology, uh, also the game pads, iPhones, Android phones, are going to completely take over consoles. And, you know, it is possible in the future that may happen as the uh, the machines get more and more powerful. We will have to wait and see on that. But um, recently, I've seen a uh, a lot of uh, releases of some familiar-looking titles in uh, different formats appearing on the iPhone. So um, it looks like um, some of the developers are actually blatantly copying things like uh, Pokemon and Mario. And I can only imagine they're trying to get people over. You know trying to appeal to Nintendo fans and things like that. Now, you know, I thought it's just a bit of a fun, this video. I thought I would do a versus because, yes, I have found a Super Mario 3D Land clone which has just come out on uh, iPhone and um, on the App Store. So we're going to do a bit of a fun comparison. It is a bit tongue-in-cheek not to be taken too seriously, but basically I don't think uh, if you're a Nintendo fan you need to be worried just yet. So let's have a quick look at Super Mario 3D Land versus the uh, iPhone version. I think it's called 3D Cart. Okay, so first up we have got Super Mario 3D Land along with Mario Music effects, graphics and 3D of course. And uh, he's as good as ever and looking pretty impressive. I like my gameplay, but he don't worry, he is up against a pretty stiff challenge, I'm afraid, because he is up against the uh, new iPhone app, 3D Cartoon Land. So, gonna well just show you a tiny little bit of that, because we've, ooh, we've done a bit of Mario. So let's move on. And let's have a look at Cartoon Land. So yes, uh, we have the uh, iPhone and we have got the rather incredible 3D Cartoon Land. So here we go. And uh, well, the music might not be Mario, but you can move your uh, little guy around. And there's coins. And, oh, game over. Let's have another go. There you go, 3D Cartoon Land Safari. Better have another go, because it was pretty awesome stuff. World 1. So you can jump. And look, there's even a block with a Mario style kind of helicopter as well. And uh, again, we can control our little guy. Although he's not that easy to control. Whoops. We can jump on the turtles. We can kick the shells. It's all looking very familiar. And. Uh, Will attempt to move again it's pretty hard so well I don't know it's going to be a close call to be honest I, I'm not sure where to go which one to pick there's just not a lot in it you know I think I think that you know the iPhone could just have it you know I think the graphics and the sound you know that piano is pretty impressive oh game over it again so you get the idea I don't know where these clones have suddenly come from, um, but they have suddenly appeared. And there's also a Pokemon one called uh, Montopia, which um, I might show you another time. And uh, I would try and show you some more of this game, but it's actually so difficult to control um, that it's pretty hard to uh, show you any more of this game. I can jump pretty well though. Ugh. Oh, there we go. 
no, I've game over it again. But you can see we've even got some uh, Goomba-like characters there that have sneaked in at the end. So um, you can see they've really gone to down on the copying. Oh, dearie me. I think I'm going to die again. Oh. And that piano is just amazing. Unfortunately, the control system is absolutely hopeless. So, let's leave it there. I don't think I'm going to get any further on that. But um, that is the um, kind of thing that's happening at the moment. You're getting some clones of Mario, you're getting some clones of Pokemon. You know, it's just, um, well, it's just ridiculous, really. I've died again. So, <laughs> I'm going to leave it there. And um, I don't think at the moment uh, Nintendo should be too worried. And uh, I don't think too many people are going to get that one, to be honest, on the uh, iPhone or iPad. So that's just my little fun comparison. And... Um, we all know that uh, iPad and iPhone can have some really good games, but um, certainly their copies at the moment, the ones that are coming up on the apps, are pretty useless. So this has been to the latest VDS games. Thanks for watching.